I took engineering, which is about as godless a subject as anyone would ever care to meet. And majored in that engineering in finite energies and thought of the finest energy I could think of it must be the human mind. Did a computation about the molecular storage of thoughts. Experimented to discover how memory was stored and found by no computation I could ever compute that it, a man couldn't remember, certainly, by this computation, more than three months worth. Because there wasn't that much storage space, because energies weren't that small. And I was proposed as a young engineer, a conundrum, of such magnitude that I went over to my very good friend, the head of St. Elizabeth's Hospital, Dr. William Allen White, and I said to him, Dr. White, what have I done now? <laughs> Expected him to tell me all about it. I was all set to have him tell me about this. I was very pleased, I was hopeful, I knew he would. And he sat there and he said, Ron, what the hell have you done?